everybody. Uh, welcome to day three of 30 videos by Chrissy. And today I want to talk about how a few months ago a new store opened up near where I work and it looked like a very fancy store. And I would walk by it every day and go, hmm, I wish I could go in there, but it looks really pricey. It's above my, above my limit of what I'll pay. And so every day I walk by it and I think that. And then every once in a while I go, Oh, I can walk in it anyway. Who cares? Even if I can't afford anything there. I can browse. And I never went in. And then this weekend I started reading a book called Blue Fishing by Stephen Sims. And it's super interesting so far. And one of the stories that he tells is about how when he was a kid in East London, his mother took him out shopping in West London. And she was looking at a Gucci bag, I believe it was, in a store window. But wouldn't even like go and look at the Gucci bag, like kind of was like peering from a real distance and when said, oh, why don't we go look in? And she said, oh no, we can't afford that. We can't go in there. And um, so I was thinking about that today when I was walking by this fancy looking store. And so today I walked into the store and to be honest, it's not even my taste, but it's a very fancy store. I was kind of intrigued. It's nice to sometimes have a little different but a scenery when I'm taking a little break from the office. So I walked in the off so I walked in the store and I looked at a couple things. And honestly, I mean the prices were a little more than I would normally pay for a shirt or a dress or a pair of pants, but certainly not anything where if I fell in love with something, I wouldn't I couldn't afford it. It's just more than I usually spend. And so I was like, oh God. I like talk myself into like this total story about this being this fancy store that I can't ex I can't afford to shop in and really it was just a little bit above what I would normally spend and so and then I also realized that everything was really not my taste so I don't know if I'll be shopping in there too often it may pop in from time to time you never know when you find the perfect thing but uh you know the moral of the story is you know just because you think you can't do something doesn't mean you can't it just means that you think you can't but once you try it, maybe you'll find out it's really not as hard or scary or as far reaching as you thought it was. So give yourself a little more credit, be creative and find ways to do the things that you don't think you can do. Thanks and have a good night.